What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2020 Panini uh, Phoenix Football. Eight box case break. Pikachu's number five sold out. And here you go. That's from a fresh case, guys. Fresh case. Let me quickly move this stuff out of the way. Alright, so here's the case over here, guys. I'm just going to quickly rip it open right here. It's just easier for me. Since it is such a big case. So remember, this one half will be for this break. The other half will be for number six, which is coming up next. Uh, in a separate video, of course. So, I don't know if you guys can see me, but... See, this one's the left side. This one is the right side. Let's roll it. One, two, three for the left. Four, five, six for the right. Six. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. This will be for this side over here. Let's roll to six. Guess who's back in the mother? And does it honestly, guys, whoever's watching, does it even feel like it's Halloween tomorrow or today? I should say. Alrighty, here we go. Hot routes, Justin Jefferson. Van Jefferson. 
At 199. Oh. Kenny Galladay. Chris Godwin. Julio Jones and Henry Ruggs relic. Ross Blacklock. It's a blue. And a flamethrowers. Matthew Stafford at two ninety nine. And a one of one. AJ Dillon. It even tells you what it is. A Nike swoosh. Wow. There you go. Green Bay Packers. Richard. Cromwell. Some late night fire. There you go, man. Marlon Davidson. Hulk Matt. Trayvon Diggs. Little uh, Devontae Parker. It's like one per box. And Hot Routes. Devontae Adams. Little AJ Brown red. Little Daniel Jones flamethrowers. <laughs> Brian Edwards. Kenneth Murray, Jerry Judy, that Kenneth Murray orange is out of 99, T Higgins, and we got a Lynn Bowden Jr., nice little three color patches, and the auto, Reyes, out of 50, go to David Duffy, Julian Edelman, game over, Jason Witten, Ryan Fitzpatrick. We got flamethrowers, Len Dawson. Jared Goff and whoop. 1,500 points. Whoa, is this a one of one? No, out of 10. Very nice. Out of 10, Dak Prescott. So everybody have a shot at this, guys. Actually, not 250 points. It's 1,500.
And a Jimmy G. In Fuego. Justin Jefferson. Anthony McFarlane Jr. Cold Matt. Next box, guys. Christopher, how's it going, brother? Happy Happy Friday night or Saturday early morning. <laughs> Next one. Rookie uh, Rising. Nice, man. That's sweet. Yeah, when I was a kid, my dad had a nice little, like, speeder boat. I was always so happy when we used to go to, like, lakes and rivers and stuff like that, like Colorado River and Lake Mead and stuff. And I remember, I always, I always tell him to this day, he always he always told me when I was a kid, don't worry, when you get older, you'll be able to drive this. You know, because I was just like five, six, seven years old. But no, he got rid of it. <laughs> and I was like, I always, I always tell him all the time, every time we see a boat, I was like, you lied to me, Dad. That's nice, man, awesome. Denzel Mims. And we got Michael Pimmon Jr.
Game over. James White. Oh, uh, well, I don't think we ever had to dock it out anywhere. Uh, I mean, we always had it at our place, but... I don't know. I mean, he had it in the early 90s. I don't know how different it is now. He had, like, a like a Sea-Doo kind of speedboat. That was pretty... Like, I, I don't know. I thought it was really fast when I was a kid. Tom Brady. But, yeah, docking over here, probably, like, leaving it at sea for sure. Yeah, yeah, I don't think it, it wasn't like one of those. Like, if you bought like a boat, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> no, it was just one of those ones like you kind of like have like a go to like lakes and, and rivers and stuff and just have a good time, right? Brandon Ayuk, little patch auto. But no, I'm sure the boat. I'm sure the boat wasn't cheap either. At, at one point, my both my parents were working. My dad did construction, and then like my mom worked for the post office. So they were able to combine both incomes, which is always great, right? Kenneth Murray. Uh, Braz, are you sure he didn't say that one day? You could. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I don't know. He told me that he was gonna be able to drive that boat. <laughs> Hey man, trust me. There's not many of us that even have a boat. <laughs> That's cool, man. That's awesome. Where the? If you don't mind me asking, what what part are you? What part are you at, Christopher? I don't even remember, man. To be honest, I don't. I don't look too much at where people live, but. Do you have any like you have ocean close to you, lakes, rivers, or is it one of those ones just more like for, to just dock out and just enjoy. Gotcha. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. That's sick, man. Jalen Rigor, I've never seen this color. Is it like a bronze or something? Out of 50. Tua. That green goes perfect with Tua right here. Out of 175. Adam Thielen. Andre Hopkins. Jerry Judy. Uh. For what? For what though? Like, uh, like collegiate NT first off the line. I'm not sure, man. Honestly, I think we were selling regular box prices. We we had them for what? One seventeen a spot, six spots. Yeah, I think hobby is closer to the high six six hundreds now, right? So I think first off the line, usually typically is a couple hundred bucks more. I'm not so good with first off the lines because I never even have a chance to get one, and then they always resell super high. Yeah, well, I would think so, man, because if hobby boxes for NT collegiate now are like around six hundred, seven hundred. A thousand doesn't seem too far off since it is first off the line edition. That that doesn't sound too too pricey to me. I would definitely look up like um blowout and in, in those places, David Adams, and see what prices they have. I would do it right now, but I'm in the middle of a break. But I usually I always like to go off of like the bigger cool the bigger retailers and see what they kind of have it at or what's close in the ballpark. But that doesn't seem too off, actually, though. For first off the line, for sure. Denzel Mims. Yeah, well, I, I, uh, if I'm gonna buy online, I'm definitely either going to Blow or David Adams or sometimes Steel City. Um, Blow usually has one of the better prices. 
David Adams, I've, I've, I've actually done a lot of shopping and, and buying with them before. Um, they usually give you, like, free gifts, and I think their shipping is probably the best out of all of them. I think they give you three free day, three day uh, select from UPS when you spend over, like, a couple hundred bucks, I believe. And then usually, like I said, if you spend X amount, you'll always get, like, free little gifts. It could be boxes. It could be packs of something. Um, yeah, David Adams. David Adams sports cards. Or David Adams card world, yeah. Antonio Gibson. I always used to shop a lot on their website before. It was it was always just cool getting a little something, right? For buying on their website. I mean, that's that's... I think that's what attracted me a lot, which I'm sure attracts a lot of people. Grand Delpit. And that's the same people that create like Hip Parade and stuff. So, Josh Jacobs. But Blowout too, we, we do a lot of business with Blowout too. They have some great stuff. Mark Cooper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, for real. Yeah, Chris I feel you, man. No, eBay, eBay is very, uh, eBay can be very uh, sketchy sometimes. There's just so many people on eBay that are just crazy scammers, and I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of great legit people that are selling boxes out there, but it's just, it's just so many people now are doing this, and it's 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 a it's a crazy world. So I mean, for the bigger online retailers. It's always, it's better to play it safe there. You know. Don't get me wrong. You can find great deals on eBay. That's just, that's just the way it is, right? On auction and bidding, whatever the case may be. Um, buy and outs, but yeah, sometimes it's a little too good to be true. I definitely would buy like cards on eBay for sure. That's usually what I mostly do, but boxes and packs um definitely online retailers sometimes if you if you have facebook man i mean some facebook groups are pretty legit and they sell on there and you can avoid buying and selling with ebay fees and stuff so that's not a bad place either to check out boxes and packs but i guess i always play it safe online either with us right we have an online store now too for the most part i think we have pretty good prices we just don't always carry all the first off the line so for your case, yeah, like a blowout on those guys would be perfect. Exactly, yeah, yeah. I think our prices are always pretty solid when it comes to hobby. We don't really ever get first off the line because honestly, I mean, <laughs> I don't know how everybody else is getting it. I mean, they might have bots and stuff, but we're always just trying to just get them like normal like everybody else on on Panini's website day of, right? And it's always crashing, but some people have connections that we don't, so we're always we're always getting the hobby stuff definitely good and having great prices. Um, but just like anybody else, right? I mean, some prices will be higher on in some products than others. But yeah, yeah, no, I, I, it's the same, man. I mean, I, I know people that legit buy with only specifically this person because they trust them. And even if their prices are higher, I mean, hell, sometimes they're superstitious too, right? I, I hit with them. I don't hit with this person, or I don't hit with them. But, yeah. Those guys are good, though. Any one of those three. Yeah, no, I, it's usually never nothing crazy. But, hey, for some party, for somebody that's trying to buy a whole case, I can see why. I don't always buy... I always, like, always tell people, too, like, we appreciate everybody that buys with us, whether it's group breaks, personal boxes. Look, man, if it's all about the deals for you, hey... I don't, I don't just shop at Nike, right? I, I shop at Adidas. Occasionally, go to Puma, right? <laughs> like, I don't just stick to one brand. I, 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 I bounce around, depending on what I find, what I like. And if I'm looking for better deals, then I'm internet shopping on different websites. Right? But for some people, right? I mean, 20 bucks is 20 bucks. But if you're going to buy a whole case, well, case of 12, 20 bucks, I don't know, man. That's $200. It will add up. You know, so as long as we're part of your rotation, it's all good. <laughs> all right, 
on, guys. Next two boxes. Dana Jones. What a break for the Packers, guys. Deshaun Watson. Now you're going to get a RPA, it looks like, out of 75 of Jordan Love. Not only did you get that A.J. Dillon gold vinyl right there, Nike swoosh tag, Jordan Love coming your way as well. Very nice break. Jake Fromm. Stay Fromm. Patriots. Ross Black Blacklock out of 50. Julian Okwara. Randy Moss. Stephon Dix. Matt Ryan. Jason Huntley. Joe Burrow. Kirk Cousins. Dalvin Cook. Rising rookie, C.D. Lamb. Out of 100. Josh Allen. KJ Hamler. Little Josh Allen, little cracked ice. Kirk Cousins. Out of 50, Dak Prescott. And Veteran Materials. Little Devin Singletary for the Bills. Going to Guy. Logan Wilson. And a nice Justin Herbert. Rookie rising to 299. Travis Kelsey. We got a redemption. T. Higgins. Rookie auto dual jersey prime yellow. Very nice. Raquan Davis. Little Gabriel Davis. And Jalen Hurts. Autograph. There you go. Very nice. For my Eagles. Fly, Eagles, fly, Jason. With that one.
Teddy B. And Joe Burrow. 53 out of 199. I have to drop my little knife in the trash can. <laughs> I'll get it out later. Alright, last two boxes, guys. Alright guys, so this should take me right to being uh, 12.55, and then Big Hit Express shouldn't take me more than 20 minutes, so we'll be right on schedule for Phoenix football number 6. And then again guys, the only other thing that sold out was uh, Big Hit Express series 5 number 11. So if there is anything we're trying to add to that, it'll have to be filled up by that 2.30 slot. So, at one point I thought, man, I'm never going to get to 2.30 or 2 o'clock. But, realistically, we're, we're like about an hour and a half away. It started at 7. Already almost going to be 2 o'clock in about an hour. Hour and 15 minutes. Xbox guys. All right, guys. Next two boxes. Amari Cooper. Antonio Ganigola. Aaron 
Aaron Jones. Jalen Ramsey. Oh, Justin Herbert. It's just a relic, though. Man. Still nice, though. There you go. Charges right there. Fire forwards. Saquon Barkley. And redemption of Cam Akers. Ra Rising rookie material signature gloves. Derek Brown. We got Patrick Queen. Antonio Gibson. So rounds with that one. Uh is that Javon the free curse? Wow, that is Javon. Out of 50. Tennessee Titans with that one. Diego. And Rams was Justin Ward. Justin Jefferson. Rookie Rising. Jerry Judy. Mari Cooper. Ed Reed. Jerry Judy. Whoa. How about a gold vinyl? Big Ben Roethlisberger. One of one. Steelers going to Michael Gallucci. Very nice, man. Mike Evans. Travis Kelsey and little Jordan Love. Nice break for the Packers. Jordan Love, a little surface scratch right there. I don't know if you guys can see it on the camera. And Chase Claypool. Barry Sanders. Gabriel Davis to 50. Nice little four color patch and auto. Bills with that one. Guy.
DeAndre Swift. Quez Watkins. And Mark Andrews, Rising Stars. Golden Tate. And Tua Togoiloa. Nick Chubb. Lame thrower, Joe Burrow. And well, there you go, guys. That was a break, so quick little recap. But a quick little recap. So we have 1,500 points that everybody has a shot at. And then let me quickly just uh, show you the hits, the relics, autos, bigger rookies, if anything, that were numbered. So there you go. Mark Andrews, Tua Togo Rookie Rising, Flamethrower Joe Burrow, Gabriel Davis, Four Color Patch, and Auto. That is numbered to 50. Big Ben Roethlisberger, Gold Vinyl. Jordan Love, Patch. Javon, uh, Curse. Cam Akers Redemption, uh, Justin Herbert uh, Relic, Rookie Rising Herbert, Burrow, T. Higgins, Jalen Hurts, nice three color patch of Devin Singletary, Grant Delpit, Joe Burrow Base, Anthony McFarlane Jr., In Fuego, Jimmy G, Henry Ruggs out of 10, Dak Prescott, Lynn Bowden Jr., Triple Relic, and Auto, Travion Diggs, a Nike swoosh, and Auto, AJ Dillon, Darrington Evans, Little Jordan Love, Ross Blacklock, Denzel Mims, Jerry Judy, Denzel Mims again, rising uh, rookie, Brandon Ayuk patch auto, Kenneth Murray, Tua Tagovailoa, and this is just a blank one right there. So there you go, guys. A couple of nice gold vinyls in this one, though. It's pretty sweet. So there you go. All right, so let's switch scenes, guys. And let's randomize the customer names that are in this break. Roll the dice, and it is a one and a four five times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, and five. Five times, one and a four. Justin Ward at the top. So there you go, 1,500 points coming your way, man. So again, this was uh, Pick Your Team number five. Number six will be coming up soon after a Big Hit Express break, which will be coming up next. Appreciate you guys, jazbeescasebreaks.com.